Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Bike Man for You. Boy, we got some, look at all of these goodies that we got going on today. We're shooting videos today. We're going to bang them out. I don't know if you're familiar with us, but we do videos twice a week. Mondays and Thursdays, and today is the day that we're going to shoot a whole bunch. That way they go in the hopper, and then we can do all kinds of other stuff. So let's get right into it. Uh, cassette removal. We've got some 8, 9, 10-speed cassettes over here, too, that we're going to be doing, some chain tools. But you got to get the cassette off once in a while for maintenance, for all kinds of stuff. That's this thing in the back. There is a difference between a freewheel and a cassette. This is a cassette, and I'm going to show you what a cassette is and how to get it off. But before we get going, we got some two beautiful tools by Originate. Uh, nice wood handle tools. We got a sprocket remover, a, uh, excuse me, a chain whip, and a lock ring removal tool. Let me show you how that works, okay? Come on, all about. First things first, we got to get that quick release off of there. I like this lock ring removal because it has the guide right down the center. So it keeps the tool, whoops, it keeps the tool nice and straight. Um, sometimes if you get the thing and it like cocks or whatnot, then it could start rounding and it could screw up the teeth on this thing and whatnot. But this has this nice long spindle that's going to fit straight into that quick release axle. And then it goes right into there like that. You with me? The chain whip, this is for a half by 3 30 seconds chain ring. It will not work on single speed. Single speed is by half by an eighth. What happens here is that this is, you know, I don't care which one. You could use this, you know, I wouldn't go real close. Leave yourself a little bit of room. But I like to get it into about like that. So that way the forward momentum is holding that on. Then my lock ring removal tool is going to go into here like that. Now notice how I got these at about, you know, about the 9 and 3 o'clock or the 6 and 9 o'clock or, you know, you're with me, right? Now here's where things get a little tricky, all right? Um, you're going to want to get in a good zenkutsu, all right? That's where you got your legs back and forth like this so that you're ready, okay? Karate. Here and here, okay? So now I'm ready. You can do zenkutsu, by the way, either way. Okay, and then you're gonna really give this thing a good push and off she comes. It's that simple, guys. If you have the right tools, it makes the job so much easier. So off this comes the lock ring. That can go on the side and then everything's gonna come right off. Your cassette is gonna come right off. Some cassettes are separate and you have to put them each on there. Some of them come complete. Some of them have a couple of loose ones, but there you go, okay? Now, putting it back on again, real simple. You do not need to chain whip. There's one of these notches that's a little bit fatter than the other one. So you have to make sure that you line up the fat one with the fat ding, and it's going to slide right on. Don't forget, if you have any spare spacers, to make sure that you get those on there. So that goes on, and then you find, there it is. That goes on. Your lock ring then goes on. And that threads in. And then you're going to take your lock ring remover. Now, you don't need the chain whip now, okay? So that's going to go right into there. You can hear it start to click. So you're going to give it a good, about like that. Voila, there she is. Originate wooden handle, nice classic pro style tools. Look at babies. Nice, right? Be proud to have those babies in your uh, in your toolbox. There you have it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Nice tools by Origin Eight. Enjoy. Get ready. We got a whole bunch of good stuff coming on. Make sure you tune in. Make sure you rate, comment, and/or subscribe. I want you to never fear. The bike man for you is here.